And another news, Parliament says it is willing to abandon all thoughts of censorship of the media if only practitioners would abide by their ethics. The remarks by the Speaker, Professor Aaron Michael Okwe, at the launch of the 70th anniversary celebrations of Graphic Communications Group Limited comes after a few weeks uh, after an incident in which Parliament, um, in Parliament which many believed was uh, an attempt to gag the media. Joy News PCA Nana Yao Safu was there and has filed the following report. It is forbidden to cover proceedings in this honorable house and go outside the chamber itself and do some other work other than coming to cover proceedings in this honorable house. I have reminded you of the fact that you are here as guests. Any such deviation will make you an unwelcome guest. These comments by the speaker were considered by many as an attempt to stifle media freedom, even though the speaker disagrees. He reiterated the media would have to respect the rules of parliament. Speaking at the launch of the 70th anniversary of the Graphic Communications Group Limited, Professor Michael Quay again reiterated the legislature respect media freedom, but added a caveat. Let me assure that in parliament we are in position and are most willing to cooperate with the media and give every opportunity for the media to report without having the temptation of censoring anything. Nevertheless, we expect that as a house, you will give us all the appropriate decorum. I believe with all my heart that is not too much to ask. The launch brought together experts in the field of journalism, representatives from government, traditional heads, and many other walks of life. Daily Graphic was launched in October 1950, seven years before Ghana gained independence. Other brands such as The Mirror, Graphic Showbiz, Junior Graphic, and Graphic Sports have also made the Graphic Communications Group a household name. The special guest of Anna used the opportunity to share his personal story about the brand. The graphic virtually first taught me to read when I was about a five-year-old boy at Asamankesi. When graphic was born, I was five years old. Reading was quite innate in me and my parents, especially my father, was keen on it. My house was a record of daily graphic. Speaking on behalf of the Ghana Journalist Association, its president, Afil Moni, also praised the group for its worthy performance over the years. So if graphic is celebrated 70, the media community in Ghana as a whole stands by them, and we hope that graphic will model the way, show the way for others, by way of um, busy, Business, business ethics by way of not only quality journalism, but how to survive in the turbulent atmosphere in which we find ourselves. The Graphic Communications Group Limited assured the public of reliable service, especially in this year's election. Professor Kwame Kakari chairs the GCGL board. It's professionalism and serve this country. This year is the election year and Graphic wants to assure all Ghanaians that it will serve its role as an independent newspaper, a newspaper that is reliable, that can be depended on for, uh, for good record and for presenting the story to the satisfaction of all, so that we will continue to build our democracy with Graphic serving that purpose. PSCA Nana Yao Safo. Join news.